Politics. Georgia's primary is next week, and the race to watch is going to be the one for governor. Yeah, it's a crowded field on the Republican side with several candidates hoping to make it to November, and there are just two on the Democratic side. Now, Fox 5 anchor Tom Haynes joins us here in the studio with a look at where those candidates stand tonight. And it all goes down Tuesday, guys, with the big primary. It's no surprise that in our Fox 5 opinion savvy poll, the current lieutenant governor, Casey Cagle, has a commanding lead among Republicans with 31% right now. Now, Secretary of State Brian Kemp comes in second place. Kemp has 20% of the vote. Former State Senator Hunter Hill is in third place with 14% of the vote as it stands right now. And businessman and former Navy SEAL Clay Tippins is two points behind Hill in fourth place at 12%. Now, State Senator Michael Williams has gotten a lot of attention over the last few days because of that controversial deportation bus. The side of it reads, fill this bus with illegals, but the bus isn't translating into votes. He comes in with just 5% of the vote. 15% of Republicans are still undecided, but as close as the rest of the race is, most political experts, including the Georgia gangs, Phil Kent believe there will be a runoff. You've got Lieutenant Governor Casey Cagle is still the front runner, but you've seen a dramatic bump for second place by Secretary of State Brian Kemp. Very interesting because mathematically there's of course going to be a runoff. Now let's look at the Democrats. Stacey Abrams has a very large lead right now with 58%. Stacey Evans gets only 19% support right now, but almost a quarter of Democratic voters still haven't picked a candidate. We talked to the Georgia gang's Theron Johnson about that. What we've seen historically is that African-American candidates do very well in Democratic primaries because overwhelming majority of people who are going to vote are going to be people of color. And she's also been able to get a very strong uh, sector of liberal progressive voters in the Atlanta metro area. Now, the primary election is next Tuesday. Polls are open from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. And you can count on Fox 5 for complete coverage of the race on Election Day. Russ? Not Tom, thanks. Turning the news.